I'm Charles McKinley Rowe, Regional QSE Manager for Jackson Civil Engineering, and I'm here today to talk about a safety feature on excavators that we've been trialling at our project in Sandwich, Kent. The safety feature is called SeatSafe, and it was introduced to us by a member of our supply chain. The system involves having a pressure sensor fitted to the seat of an excavator, which will deactivate all of the controls in the machine if the driver takes his weight off the seat. It will deactivate all hydraulics, including any operation to reverse the machine, slew the machine, track forward, or operate the dipper, the boom, or the bucket. This will work even with the dead man handle on. The idea behind the system is to help prevent some of the common uh, bad practices, uh, bad habits, and unsafe actions carried out by some excavator operators. To demonstrate, we've mocked up several common scenarios to show the system in operation. Here we have the operator standing up in his cab to get a better view when excavating a deep trench. Here we have the operator leaning out of the side window to get a view of when he's reversing. And here we have the operator being approached by a member of the team to ask for his permit. and also him leaving his seat to take his jacket off. As you can see, in all instances, the machine was shut down and all the controls were unable to operate each time when he left his seat. So far, the feedback from the operator using this system on site has been very positive. I'm Colin. I've been driving excav excavators, uh, rubber ducks and uh, excavators of all sizes for 45 years. This is a Hyundai 210. It was fitted with a seat safe system about a month ago and I can't see any fault in it at all. I think it's a jolly good idea. I think it's going to stop a lot of accidents as it seems to cut everything out on the machine as soon as you lift off the seat. I think it's a jolly, a jolly good idea. I just wish it would have come out a lot sooner and saved a few more accidents. We're pleased with the feedback from Colin as we believe that anyone required to use such a system must be comfortable with it. With this trial being a success, we'll be looking to promote this idea throughout our company and with the rest of our supply chain.